My name is Terry Upper and I'm playing the gas meter reader and alternate for Mr Twit. G'day, my name's Dylan Underwood and I'm playing Mr Twit. Hi guys, my name is Martha Talia and I'll be playing Mrs Twit. Kia ora, my name is Jacinta Compton and I'm playing the role of Muggle One. Hi, my name is Matilda Chua and I'm a puppeteer and the understudy for Muggle One. Kia ora, my name is Isabella Tim, I play the roly poly bird. Kia ora, my name is Francesca Brown or Frankie and I'm the understudy for all of the characters except Mr. Twit. Oh, my favourite trick for Mr. and Mrs. Twit will be knock door run, where you knock on the door and you run away and they have to come out of the door and get really annoyed because there's nobody there. <laughs> yes, yeah. Um, I just do, I do the banana peel on the ground. To, and like call somebody in and see if they slip up on it just to see if it's as slippery as it is in the cartoons mm -hmm. I reckon Just put a poop on the bed and maybe not <laughs> fart in their face or something <laughs> <laughs> they're, they're the type of people to deserve that type of stuff <laughs> <laughs> I would play a trick on Mr and Mrs Twit where they would have to be nice to each other and others they had to, they had to, yes <laughs> I would do something subtle, like um, change the light bulb so that yellow to white is without questioning <laughs> why things are different in your house, or steal batteries out of electronics mm -hmm. so that oh, why yeah. nothing's working. Yeah, that's a goodie. Um, I would probably, I'd probably just be a little rat and go and chew through a bunch of their wires outside their house so they have no electricity left and no heating and no Wi-Fi. I would set up uh, multiple speakers around their house so they always thought the tap was dripping, but when they walked into that room the speaker would stop and obviously the tap wouldn't be dripping, so they'd just think they were constantly running up their water bowl. I would store granulated Powerade so I could stay hydrated. <laughs> um, I would store mashed potatoes with gravy because I really like potatoes. <laughs> yum, yum. Um, following a similar consistency, I think I'd go for some guacamole and then hopefully there'd be some like leftover little corn chips that I could fish out of there. <laughs> I would store frozen dumplings mm -hmm. so that later on they'd be thawed out. <laughs> and if it's a hot day, hopefully they'd cook. Yep. <laughs> Ooh, a day as any animal. I, I would want to be a leopard. Those big, long, beautiful, big cats that can like climb trees. Um, and demo as well. Oh, perfect. Like that. Like this. Oh, meow. Ooh. I think I would be a starfish. Yeah. Just because they're chilling all day and they always got that perfect uh, position in bed where they're just like, uh, that's perfect. I could do this all day. If I could spend the day as any animal, I would choose to be a unicorn, of course. Um, they blend my two favorite things, which is horses and fantasy um, and a, a demo. So um, we'll, we'll just, um,